Megatron, Fox are still trying to push in and hide. This is in the middle of it. Oh, Zuxi, he's got spot on two members right there. That's gonna be evil. Junk can't get it taken out, and Bucky will fall alongside him. Well, we're looking at Megatron great aliens here trying to secure themselves in towards the next phase, but they get clipped out instead. Oh! FFQ Jumper running them out, and now. FFQ secures a total of three points, but the, the fight is still not over yet. Look at NFT, they're struggling right outside, and Hein gets caught out instead. It's going to be NFT Esports here having Maskaga right next to Bigatron Esports. That circle is causing so much mayhem. The rotation is coming in for all of the teams, and Mega Conquer is going up against Burp Burp Burp. Both tie teams going head to head. That's going to be a grenade coming up from Stones, and now we, he might just find the claim. Oh. That's now we going out. That was a huge snake coming out of them. And now Mascara got going in for the fight. Close quarter combat action coming from the side of NFT. And Microboy is trying to pop one nade up. Then Mascara got forced to flush over the back. Cole is just waiting for him to possibly go in for the pickup. But Suxy's hopping right through. Oh, what is he doing? Said, what in the world is going on? But Michael Boy. One going in. And Michael Boy going in for the rectus speed. He breaks oh! the level. Oh! Red Aliens falls down to the ground on ninth place. And then NFT with the defense in the hut as well. We have absolutely no idea what Bigger Trump were doing there. They crawled into the house. They got taken out. Wow. I did not expect Zoxy to hop right through. And now NFT Esports ripping out the rewards. And the next one to fall will be FFQ. D2 is getting straight out by Pond as well. He's going to secure that one kill in the back. Yeah, Paul is coming in from afar, but he's got Ryu pushing in from behind him. Drone with the drop shot as well. He's gonna get a headshot in, but here comes the reply coming out from Paul's D2E on the ground, and the circle is closing in. We got Boyk coming in, falling in out onto the blue, but online 24 still trying to spray onto Ryu, and Warang is the only remembering member of Ryu. And in the blink of an eye, we see so many squads falter. Now it's our top six. Ryu only down to one man. It's all up to Drone to actually pull this off. It's gonna be RRQ Atina taking out. And Mega Conqueror is one member out, and it's all up to Rob Fiat to actually go in for the pickup there. And there goes Loki and GE trying to find Maskaga. Maskaga does not have much choice but to tank out that circle. They managed to beat Bigotron as they were pushing into the hub, but can Maskaga do these by himself? We are down to our final five teams. Stand still alive, oh. and here comes Rob Fiat with the oh. grenade. That's gonna remove you! That grenade! That was a sick name. They already knew that they're hiding right behind him. And now here comes the threat down. And Maskaga, the next one to fall. Here comes the top four. We still have Mega Congress here. Tagging up on towards Ryu. And Drone is going to be the last one standing for the side of Ryu. Now in the top three, we have Vietnam as well as Thailand here to do it all out. We spoke about how good Mega Conquerors are when it comes down to UDDs. And time and time again, we have seen the grenade plays and they removed GE off the map. We are down to our final two teams, both. So Ernie can only rely on his firepower. He is being flushed out, so he does not want to give this point away. He's just going to wait till the zone takes him off. And this will be the very first round being secured by Mega Conquerors. Absolutely fantastic and clinical finish coming in from the tie side. And 